U.S. Mobile. Custom cell phone plans at affordable prices. How do you sign up? I'll tell you. First, order a SIM starter kit. Don't worry, it includes both the GSM and Super LTE SIM cards, so you can choose between all of U.S. Mobile's plans, even their unlimited ones. SIM cards arrive a week later. Open them up, marvel at their beautiful design, or... Maybe that's just me because I've tried a few SIM cards in my day and none have looked quite this good. Okay, back to the video. Follow the instructions on the left. Head online to US Mobile's website. Sign in, click activate. Choose between the GSM network or the Super LTE network. Oh yeah, now's probably a good time to tell you. GSM LTE and Super LTE are code for T-Mobile and Verizon networks. How do I know? I tried them out, both of them. And guess what? On the speed test app, it says T-Mobile and Verizon. So there you go. U.S. Mobile probably can't tell you which networks they use because of agreements they've made, but I'm not U.S. Mobile. So I can tell you, T-Mobile and Verizon, simple as that. Anyway, choose your network, whichever provides the better coverage in your area. Enter your zip code and the SIM ID located on the back of the SIM card. I know it's long, but I don't make the rules here. You can transfer your existing number if you have one by clicking this button. Enter your phone number, select your previous carrier, enter your old account info, submit porting. Want a new number? Great. Scroll down and customize your plan. Build it exactly how you like it. Even get unlimited data on the Verizon network at the cheapest price around, $35 a month. Once you're done, scroll down and confirm your payment method. And oh, hey, there's even a promo code section. Anyway, agree to the terms and bam, activate. You're good to go. Time to put the SIM card into your phone. But how do you open that pesky SIM card tray? Good news, taped to the back of your activation kit is a SIM eject tool. I needed one of those. Huzzah, it connected to the network. Or if you're on Verizon, you have to wait a little bit for it to activate. Just be patient, give it a moment, maybe have that snack you've been thinking about. Okay, good to go, time to test. Messaging, yes. LTE data, loads fine. Calling, yup, it's working. Group and picture messaging, ah, uh, well, there's a catch. If you chose GSM LTE on the T-Mobile network, watch this video on how to get group and picture messaging working on US Mobile. If you chose the Verizon network, the Super LTE SIM card, congrats, it's already working. Okay, last feature, personal hotspot. Does it work? Fingers crossed. Yes, it does. Okay, good to go. That's how you sign up and get activated on US Mobile. Stop overpaying for cell service, start paying for exactly what you use, or get the cheapest unlimited plan out there on the Verizon network. Ready for more content? Subscribe for the full review of US Mobile and how they compare with the rest of the cell phone plans out there. Until then, I'm Stetson, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.